family owned and operated since 1993. My mom and her brother, my uncle, started baking pies. But it started long before then when my great aunts and grandma would make pies for different catering events and in a pizza shop. And the demand became so large for the pies that we opened up a separate pie shop just to accommodate the demand of the product. The recipes, they came from a combination of my great aunts and then just tweaking them from my mom and uncle. We bake daily and uh, we have 36 different flavors we bake daily. We always tell people if you're coming in for something very specific to either you can call ahead to make sure we have it, or we'll set it aside, or you can order it a couple days in advance. And that way you're guaranteed to get what you are looking for. All of our pies are made by hand. All of the fruit, all the pudding that goes into the pies, everything is hand scooped and weighed out. They hand scoop all the fruit in and based off of whatever flavor they're working on, they put the lid on. We have a machine that crimps the lids on to seal the pie up and then we milk and sugar wash it before it goes into the oven. Something really popular is our crumb top pies. It's a it's a sweet and streusel uh, topping, so it gives the pie a little extra crunch and sweetness to it. And those are made first during the day. And when they come out of the oven, you can kind of see them bubbling up and boiling. So they're always fun because you can kind of see the, the fillings on the inside. We do use lard in our crust, which is what gives it the extra flakiness. There's no fluff or added preservatives. Um, when you come and feel the, the weight of our fruit pies, a lot of the time, when people originally, like when they first pick them up, they can't believe the weight in it. It's because we use real ingredients. It just gives it a nice special touch that each individual pie was handmade. I say with love. My favorite pie is our strawberry cream cheese pie. That's made in the summertime. In the fall, I like to eat our caramel apple walnut, which is our apple pie with chopped walnuts in the filling, and they drizzle caramel on the top. But I'm also a big fan of our pumpkin pie. We make pumpkin pie all year round. So we make it 365. Not everyone does that. On a day, a, a slow day, 500, we can go all the way up to eight to 10,000 a day. And that would be around the holiday times where Thanksgiving, we're making 30,000 pies in the three days leading up to Thanksgiving day. We are known for our strudels as well. And we make different types of sugar cookies, chocolate chip peanut butter. And those are just things that we make, I say, on the side. So we might not always have peanut butter cookies, and that's because our bakers were too tired at the end of the day to make the cookie dough. <laughs> For me, it's amazing every year to see the amount of customers that come in around Thanksgiving and Christmas, the amount of support that we have from the community. And it can get kind of daunting in the back, and it can get very tiresome, and you just want to go home and not pack any more pies at Thanksgiving. And then you realize that those 30,000 pies all have a home in somebody else's home. And so all of those pies, you're part of somebody else's Thanksgiving or Christmas dinner, or even sometimes just birthdays. When you take a moment to think about that, that's when you kind of start to get a little bit humbled and you appreciate that they're choosing us, they're choosing a Mama Joe pie to be on their table for a holiday.